Yes! Okay. How much does this cost? Because we'd love to bring this back to North Dakota. Oh, look at this. And then look up at the Look at this. Job number one. Welcome to the honeymoon suite of the airport. I feel like the, the chauffeur for a Taylor Swift concert. Oh, look at We almost hit Mrs. Schweiger. Yes, Come on, everybody. Now keep your hands inside the cab at all times. I'm going to show you the Space Needle. I'm going to take you down to where Jim Lovell took off from Model 13. And we're going to go to a few fast food restaurants. Time aboard. I'll promise you one more thing. scheduled the game for this purpose, to go challenge our team on the road, a top team in the country, and you know, on top of that, it was hot, humid. I want to hear anybody say heat or hot. You're going to be the toughest and the most disciplined football team that wins this game today. Great focus, perfect effort, huge opportunity. Let's go punch him in the mouth, all right? Let's go. Box on three, one, two, three. How do we handle it? Well, you handle it by focusing on the game, the game plan, and your preparation throughout the week. And I felt like our guys really had good focus. Yeah, we were definitely expecting a, a hard, tough battle. And, um, you know, we just wanted to go in there. We had a great opportunity against a great team. We knew that they're ranked number five in the nation, so we kind of had to come in with a little extra, like, extra stuff to us. It was a fun game. 60 minutes, we're going to be the toughest team. We're going to be the most focused team, the most disciplined. Let's get out there for 60 minutes of great effort. You understand that? Yes, See, I want this thing now. 60 minutes, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We thought it was going to be a really physical football game, and I thought our guys handled it well, and I thought, you know, kind of set the tone in the first half. Our guys really did a good job. I don't think much affected them, whether it was, you know, the, the environment, the heat, whatever. They just kind of buckled it up and went to work. Brady Oliveira at the tail. Here's the gift to Brady, and the Manitoba Moose is in the end zone. Touchdown, North Dakota, and UND strikes first, leading it 6 to nothing. Oh, oh, not, boys. We expected to see a team that was really explosive at the receiver position, big strong arm quarterback that was committed to running the football. Way too much time, throw your fastball. We try to maintain the ball, you know, and then and obviously you want to finish drives with scoring points, and I think we did that in the first half. To a 26-yard field goal attempt for Leach, the snap, the placement, the kick is on its way. The ball is through, it's good, and North Dakota has taken a 10-7 lead. Let's go, Let's go. Big fellas. Let's go. We had the run game going for us, so we, we came in thinking we were going to establish a run with them. Cunningham keeps it himself, spins into the end zone, and it's a touchdown for North Dakota. Nate Cunningham, one yard plunge, and it's 16 to 7 UND. We executed the game plan. The first half is what we were really looking for. They made some adjustments, and they have good players. And they made some plays uh, in the third quarter. So they had momentum, and then they got the ball back, had momentum, got the ball back. We had an unfortunate uh, breakdown on special teams. Cade Peterson to send it away. It's blocked at the five. It is blocked. They had the ball a lot of times, uh, second and one, uh, maybe first and goal from the four, situations like that. And we really made them earn it, I thought, you know, in, in the entire night. And 
that was a credit to our guys. They just they just kept fighting and uh, made them snap it again. And, and you know, you do that, you give yourself an opportunity to be able to win a football game when it's when it's when it's touch or uh, field goals instead of touchdowns. We've been talking about the play action since halftime. We knew the one play action we were gonna, hey, we're gonna take a shot here. We're just trying to pick the right spot. On that long pass play, I actually walked in the huddle and I saw what Rudy had called and I, I said, hey guys, watch this. Kellerham fakes the toss going downfield. This could be one if Adioti can get under it. It is caught by Izzy Adioti. Adioti put it in. There's an explosive play. Izzy ran that, that deep ball and made a heck of a play and then we just strung a few plays together. We converted one fourth down and then we got it to fourth down and eight and felt like at that point in the game we had to go for a touchdown to try to win the football game. I love y'all! Believe! The game hinging on this play perhaps. So here it is, fourth and goal from the eight. Kenneringham delivers, the ball is caught by Wanzik! Touchdown, North Dakota! Noah Wanzik catches in the end zone, and we're tied at 23. Well, I knew it was a good play call. Um, I caught a lot of passes off that play, and I knew it was going to work. Oh, it's 97 Y hook X switch. They saw the same thing that we wanted them to see, and, and uh, they both made a heck of a play. I looked at the outside, and I saw one-on-one -on -one with Wanzik, and that's, that's not what you really want to do with that big of a body and those solid hands. So I, Gave him a shot and he came down with it. You know, the whole play was kind of just a blur. I guess I didn't really have to do much. Just had to stand there and catch it. I think the sweat stopped for just a second and then she started rolling again, but it was just one of them quick seconds, if you will. <laughs> the guys came through and then kicked the extra point to go ahead, and then it was an opportunity for our defense to go out there and get a stop. Fourth down and two for Sam Houston State. Here's the shovel pass, Jackson. He's not gonna get it. He's gonna be short, and North Dakota has turned over Sam Houston on downs. Holy cow! And this one is over. North Dakota has taken down the Bearcats. UND is gonna win it tonight in Huntsville, 24 to 23. Wow! Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I guess a lot of fun that uh, you know. Now we get to this point and move forward. Yeah. <laughs> Obviously you can't let it like get to your head, like you can't be too cocky about it, but you gotta come to work and grind every single day. So that's definitely a momentum builder and it's a confidence builder and we, we build off that and just keep the season going. Ah, that's a dog!